So, dua plus my side equals three in Ilocano. Nag la ing. <laughs> I'm trying to remember. Kumusapo, welcome to the channel, Ka. Or, hi guys, it's me, Kaylee. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> For today's video, you guys are gonna be studying with me. But first, we are gonna go outside because I'm very hungry and I heard that. Booster juice is here, guys, again, again. So now we're gonna be going there for the second time after about three weeks or one week. And I did a video going to Booster Juice. If you guys haven't watched that video, recommend you watch right now after you finish watching this one. Well, let's get on to it and I'll see you when we get there. Bye for a second. Woo, Booster Juice! Is the nice booster juice area. Ah. Hi guys, I officially got my order. I have one drink here. I'm holding three, two drinks here. I have a strawberry sunshine. I don't know what's this one. I think this one's for my dad. I think it's also strawberry sunshine, if you guys can tell the color, pretty much. And I also got two hot dogs here, one for me and my aunt, probably. And then we have another one for my dad, a big hot dog for my dad. It, it's kind of hard, I'll try to open it, but I'll show you guys probably later what it, how it looks like. But there it is, two hot dogs. For some reason, they put it in the little um, box, they each have to, so then there'll be one and another one. It's pretty cool. Mm. Okay, for today's video, you're gonna we're gonna be doing a study with me video. So for my study with me video, I'll be teaching you guys how to add and subtract fractions. The first equation for um, fractions, we're gonna be doing the long method way that I've learned for the past three weeks, and now I'll be showing you guys how I do it. So now let's begin. So we're gonna start with one half, one half plus one fourth. Right there, right there, big for you. And also we'll have the equation there. So the first thing we are gonna go to find to find our answer will be what is the least common denominator? If you guys don't know what's the least common denominator and you can't find out, then maybe you should go back to your multiplication timetable. So now let's relook. So for the twos would be two, four, six, and eight. And then for the fours would be four, eight, 12, and of course, 16. Hmm, so who do we find first? So we do see four, but there's also eight here. You guys can see? There's also eight. But the first one you can see would technically be four, so it would be four. So then four would be at the bottom. The four will be used to divide with the two, con the two denominators and the common denominator. And now we're gonna begin dividing. So what is four divided by two? That would be, the answer would be two. So then you would multiply or multiply with one. Would multiply it with the one. I mean two. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm starting to forget my multiplication table. Two. So then the two would go on the line here and it would also have the addition symbol because it's right now we are on adding. That's why. Okay, the next thing we're gonna go, we can't just leave the other side left-handed. So we're gonna go to the left side. So here you're looking at the your caught less common denominator and also your four here that we haven't touched yet. So now we are gonna divide them and four divided by four is technically one. So then we're gonna also multiply with this one right here. That's where it got mixed up, <laughs> silly me. Then we would have the one right there. And now it's time to add. So now let's proceed. So dua plus my side equals three in Ilocano. Nag 
Laughing. I'm trying to remember it. Very sorry. So then now we're going to put the three and the fours that we have our three fourths right there. On to the next equation. Let's flip our paper. There we go. Okay, now let's flip. So now we're going to do three one third plus one half. This one is a pretty easy one for you guys. So we're gonna begin. So we are going to have to multiply, but if you guys want to, you can also use your multiplication table. Also, always look for your least common denominator. It will always help you. So now let's check our multiplication table. Okay, for the twos, we're gonna go through the twos again if you don't remember. Two, four, six, and eight. And then for the threes that we haven't really really, I mean, done yet is three, six, nine, and 12. Hmm, what is our least common denominator, guys? Wait, I can see one, guys. Look, guys, there's six right there, six. Six, so it would be six because three times two is six. Right there, so I already finished one of my equations there. On to the next one. We are now gonna officially divide, which six divided by three is two. So then we would also multiply it, would be two. Then we would have two on the line there. On to the next thing. I remember, don't leave the other side hanging. So now we are gonna divide. Two divided by six is three. That would be three <laughs> plus three. Okay. Now we're gonna add. Dua plus cat law equals five, or two plus three in English. Now five sixths. There we go, we have our answer completed. Woo! For our last final equation, we are gonna do adding. So for our next equation, we're gonna do one, out of seven plus one fifth equals. Same deal, but we're just gonna be finding the least common denominator by using your multiplication table or your table. Or simply multiply seven times five. Or you could do your multiplication table so I can exercise in my brain and you can also exercise your brain. So maybe we can go for seven, 14, 21, and 28. And then for the fives, five, 10, 15, and 20. Do you see one? So now we're gonna proceed if we can't see one here since I don't see any least common denominator yet. So then there would be 35, maybe that'd be good there, and then 25, 30, and 35. There we go, so we finally see it. I'm gonna give you guys a little hint. It's 35, woohoo! So you can find 35 there. So then technically it would be 35 because seven times five or five times seven would be 35. So 35 would go here. So now let's just erase this very quickly. There we go, I'm just gonna go and erase this very quick. Okay, so now we're gonna put 35 back there since I accidentally erased it. So now we can use the least common denominator, which is 35, and divide with our seven, our lower value. So 35 divided by seven is five. So then you would multiply it with the one right here is five. So then we would put five on the line. Also 
pull the plus sign since we are in adding right there. So the next thing you would do, you can't just leave the other side left handing. So then we would do 35 divided by 5 is 7, which is 7. So then we we'll put 7 on the line. It will equal, I put the equal right here. So 5 plus 7 is 12. And then we have 35 at the bottom. Right there. So we have 12 to 5. So there you have seen this nice, beautiful study with me video. We learned fractions, how to add. Well, hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Also, don't forget to hit the notification button to be notified when my newest uploads come out. Don't forget to share this with your friends so that people around the world can learn how to act just like me. And bye, bye, bye,